Hello everyone, this is Christopher in Japan. And I'd just like to make a short video, um, which I'll call Tiptoeing on the Shoulders of Giants. Um, recently, I assembled a 3D printer, and I've been exploring things on that since. Uh, I would describe the experience of the assembly as basically a hole-in-one. Um, I put it together, and it worked as advertised, which is wonderful. Uh, I'd like to talk about that maybe a little bit more in a future episode. Another thing I'd like to discuss in some future episodes is some of the issues that I had in assembling it. Uh, not as criticisms, but perhaps as um, beneficial learning experiences, uh, both for myself and perhaps for others too. Uh, I'm still in the process of going through a learning curve. I've been printing out little knickknacks and things that I've found. Uh, they were on the SD card from the manufacturer and that were have, that I found on Thingiverse and other places. Uh, just to sort of get my uh, head around this whole concept and learn uh, about all the little things that you need to understand. I'd just like to express um, extreme gratitude to both the creators of this printer, Joseph Pru Prusa and his staff, and all the people behind the RepRap project uh, that have turned out such incredible things. Uh, to the folks at Niro who created this robot that I assembled last year, uh, this really got me interested in 3D printing. It was the first application of, practical application that I'd ever seen of 3D printing with my own eyes. And I'd also like to thank the countless people on the internet and on YouTube who have shared their experiences and the issues that they've faced in assembling 3D printers and then um, working on 3D prints been incredible to see all the wonderful things that people have shared and I look forward to trying to make a small contribution myself. Thank you for watching and please uh, by all means uh, keep uh, commenting and asking questions and look forward to seeing you on future episodes. Matane.